Did we just win? We just win! My bow is drawn. What's going on, guys? With a world of free-to-play games available and not wanting to get killed every day by hackers in Warzone, where do you begin to look? Well, in this YouTube series, my goal is to give you first impression reviews of new and not so new games that are free to play so you can discover and enjoy some of the best free to play games on the internet. Let's go. Let's start this series off with Dota 2. Dota 2 is a game of strategy, momentum and non-stop action. Two teams of five players face off on an epic tabletop style battlefield. You and four teammates then ride into battle with assistance from AI called Creeps. In short, the end goal is to destroy the opposing team's ancient or have them surrender. So before you start the game, there's a section for learning if you are literally brand new. And it shows it's a series of eight different videos. Um, two minutes, ten minutes, three minutes, three minutes, three minutes. It goes on and on. And you got <laughs> small disclaimer, guys. There's actually more than eight videos. Um, but this is literally the first time I've ever played this game. Um, I thought there was eight, but there's actually way more videos if you just click along these buttons right here. Um, but ultimately, my advice is to do all the instructional videos. It teaches you all the basics you need to know about the game. Um, it's definitely worth doing before you go into your first battle. So now, then we'll play a game right now, uh, and then I'll give you a heads up about what it is. Goodness me. Honestly, it's important to notice that literally for the first like 15 minutes of my first game on this, I was button bashing, you know, trying to figure out how to actually use different powers and um, heal myself and try to attack. Um, I definitely think I got the hang of it in the end, um, but there's certainly some pointers that I can give you along the way. Cue awkward moment where I let the battle continue while I learn how to heal. I'll cut a notch with your name on it. This guy's is a great example of why you should pick the perfect hero before you go into battle. I just found myself in a close range fight and just watch how fast my health gets depleted. Yep, dead already. I'm ch I'm currently dead. I can buy back right now. Happy days. I want to do that. Um, buy some more potions. They save your life, believe me. So, essentially, the battle is ferocious constantly. You constantly have to be involved. Yes. And you have to move forward in battle. I think one of the reasons this game is so great is you can't pay to win. Each round is progressive, and as you get closer and closer to defeating the opposite team's ancient, you can upgrade your powers to make them even more powerful, which is going to give you the edge in that final battle. Keep killing! Come on, blow it up, 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 boom! See you later, son. I need some more armor. Guys, it's really important to remember that even when you think you're getting that close to winning, the enemy team can come along and show you who's truly boss. I mean, look at this. There you go. I don't know whether I'm actually winning this right now or not. I 
don't know where my player is right now. Me! There she is. See, if you get in the way of these people, they just mess. <laughs> See, I was destroying their thing, and then they all realized what was going on, and they came to absolutely whoop my ass. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Damn. Six seconds, and I'm back. I just don't know whether this was the best bloody one to use or not like I don't even know what's going on oh we're, oh, we're going to battle again okay the enemy's middle tower has fallen the enemy's middle tower has fallen Woo! the most complicated game I've played, but it's great fun. Okay, so you have to move your player, you do die, you can respawn, but then you have to replenish all of your power-ups, your healing, your weapon power, and as you battle and as you get better, the weapons also level up. <laughs> okay, so that was super fun. Difficult as hell. I don't really know... <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right. So this leaves me with the sum up, the conclusion, if you will. Literally, I had the best time playing the game. And honestly, with over a hundred heroes, with hundreds and hundreds of different powers, the situations you can, strategies you can find yourself in are always going to be different. It is literally endless fun and it is free to play. I literally continued to play this game for hours after filming. I had so much fun with it. The game is extremely dynamic and every battle is different. If you enjoyed this video, guys, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell icon so you can be notified every time we release a new video. And lastly, please join me on the next First Impressions video. Thanks for watching.